Hello children. Now that you have understood the concept of multiplication and the terms that indicate it, let us continue with the topic and learn short multiplication. If you get a question, multiply 3 and 12, you will write 3 into 12 and the product is 36 because you know the tables 3 12s are 36. But if you are asked to multiply 42 by 4, you will write 4 into 42 but you do not know the product because you know the tables of 4 only till 4 12s are. You do not know how much 4 42s are. For that, you need to know short multiplication which we are going to learn in this video. Let's begin. Multiply 42 by 4. First, you have to arrange the multiplicand and the multiplier. Write the multiplicand 42 on the first line and below that, put the multiplication sign and write the multiplier 4. Then draw the line and start multiplying. First, multiply 4 which is the multiplier into the units digit in the multiplicand. That is 4 into 2 which is equal to 8. Then multiply 4 into the, the tenth digit in the multiplicand. That is 4 into 4 which is equal to 16. 16 is a two digit number. So you will write 6 in the tens place and 1 in the hundreds place. The answer or the product is 168. The next sum is multiply 39 by 2. Write the multiplicand 39. Below that put the multiplication symbol and write the multiplier 2. Then start multiplying first. 2 into 9 which is equal to 18. 18 is a two digit number so we leave 8 in the units place and carry over 1 and write it above the tens digit in the multiplicand. Then multiply 2 into 3 which is equal to 6 plus add the carry over 1 that is equal to 7. Write 7 in the tenths place of the product. Answer is equal to 78. Another sum. Multiply 54 by 5. Arrange the multiplicand and the multiplier. 54 into 5 and start multiplying. First, 5 into 4 is equal to 20. Leave 0 in the unit in its place and carry over 2 and write it above 5 in the tens place. Then multiply 5 into 5 which is equal to 25 plus the carry over 2 equal to 27. When you write 27, write 7 in the tens place and 2 in the hundreds place. The answer or the product is 270. Another question. How much is 6 times 18? Now you know that in multiplication, the multiplicand and multiplier can be interchanged. So when you arrange the numbers for short multiplication, always write the greater number as the multiplicand and the smaller number as the multiplier. In this sum, We'll write 18 as the multiplicand and 6 as the multiplier. Begin by multiplying 6 into 8 which is equal to 48. Carry over 4 and write it above 1. Then multiply 6 into 1 which is equal to 6 plus the carry over 4 which is equal to 10. The answer or the product is 108. Now let us find the product of 245 and 4. Write the multiplicand 245 into the multiplier 4. Start with 4 into 5 equal to 20. 
carry over 2 and write it above 4 in the tens place and then multiply 4 into 4 equal to 16 plus the carry over 2 equal to 18. So write 8 in the tens place and carry over 1 and write it above 2 in the hundreds place. In the end multiply 4 into 2 which is equal to 8 plus the carry over 1 is equal to 9. The answer or the product of 245 and 4 is 980. Next, let us see how to find the third multiple of 378. Third multiple of 378 means you have to multiply 378 into 3. 3 eighths are 24. So you write 4 and carry over 2. Then multiply 3 sevenths are 21. Plus the carry over 2 is equal to 23. So write 3 and carry over 2. Last multiply 3 threes are 9 plus the carry over 2 is equal to 11. 1 in the hundreds place and 1 in the thousands place. The third multiple of 378 is 1134. Before we end, let's quickly practice few sums. First sum, 284 into 6. Multiply 6 4s are 24. So write 4 and carry over 2. Then multiply 6 8s are 48. Plus the carry over 2 is 50. So write 0 and carry over 5. Then 6 2s are 12. Plus the carryover 5 is 17. The product is 1704. Second sum 492 into 2. First multiply 2 twos are 4. There is no carryover here. So next you multiply 2 nines are 18. Write 8 and carryover 1. Then Multiply 2 4s are 8 plus the carryover 1 is equal to 9. The product is 984. Last, solve 607 into 5. First, multiply 5 7s are 35. So write 5 and carry over 3. Then, 5 zeros are 0 plus the carryover 3 is 3. No carryover here, so multiply 5 6s are 30. The product is 3035.